Hi, I'm Michael Lewis, and I'm looking forward to the Energy Institute's Powering Net Zero conference, where I'll be talking to some of the leading figures in the zero carbon debate, from the public sector, from the private sector, and indeed from industries across the digital economy through to the future of air travel. We'll be looking at what net zero means. But for me, the customer end of the energy transition is critical, and that's why customer engagement is critical to the zero carbon debate, whether that's decarbonizing homes, decarbonizing businesses, or indeed decarbonizing entire cities and the transport networks that connect them. And that's why we'll be asking some of the key questions around the energy transformation and the transformation to zero carbon. For instance, how do customers make the right choices to invest in green homes and how do we incentivize them to make the right choices? What does a green transport system look like? What does a green city look like? And why are we still talking about energy efficiency after all these years when we know the economic and environmental benefits it can bring? At E.ON, we believe that the 2020s has to be a decade of action. That means investing in green skills, green jobs and delivering green economic growth, because we know that will not only deliver net zero, but it will deliver better local air quality and better health outcomes. And these are just some of the benefits in transforming to a zero carbon economy. And we know that with the right approach, with the right policies and with the right investment, we can deliver this zero carbon objective because we've done it before. We built an entire global industry offshore wind from a standing start 20 years ago, which means we're rapidly replacing coal-fired power generation as a key part of the energy mix. We need to replicate that success downstream with our customers. And we'll be asking all of the questions about how we transform the customer experience in a zero carbon world. I hope you'll join me for the discussion. Thank you.